Hi friends and students, we have seen many squares uh, till now, right? 1 to 40 squares we learnt and also 91 squares to 110 squares we have seen and squares ending with the uh, 5s also we have seen. Now we are going ahead with the uh, 41 to 60 squares. So how easily we can remember these things and all we will uh, discuss uh, in this session. So 41 to 60 and uh, we do know 45 square right what is 45 square ending with 5 square means the uh, last uh, two digits will be 25 and uh, whatever the other digit is there apart from 5 that has to be multiplied with the next consecutive number or digit so 4 after 5 4 5 is a 20 25 same like that even for 55 5 5 is a 25 last two digits so apart from 5 what is the other digit is there 5 5 has to be multiplied with uh, 6 5 6 is a 30 25 and we do know 60 square is nothing but uh, 36 uh, 0 0 50 square you do know that uh, 5 5 is a 25 double 0 right from 32 square onwards uh, till 99 square you will be having four digit values 31 square is the last two digit square value which ends with uh, three digit values so from 100 square onwards till 316 square so we have five digit values now how to remember from 41 to 60 always remember 41 square to 60 squares in order to move ahead so for 41 square what is first four square 16 so 41 square starts with a 16 in that way you can remember so if 41 square starts with a 16 and uh, continues so 16 after 17 42 square 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 continuation 26 27 28 29 30 31 32 33 34 continuation breaks here that is the reason from 61 onwards so we are not going ahead with 37 38 like that it looks like very easy right from 16 17 18 19 and all but not easy to recollect if i ask what is 47 square what is 47 square 41 square starts with 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 not easy right so writing is easy remembering is uh, not an easy one so what is the other method we can go ahead so looks like very easy approach but not easy to remember that is the reason we are not approaching this method we are going ahead with the other method that we will see so it will be the best method i can say and easy to remember also now can you observe so from 41 to 60 we are focusing only on unit digits only on the 41 to 50 unit digits means 1 1 square 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 0 here also 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 and 0 we are focusing only on unit digits only and thereby we can easily find out the squares for 41 to 50 and also 51 to 60 how we will see now here 1 is there and here 16 is there 2 is there 17 is there 3 is there 18 is there 4 is there 19 is there can you tell me what is the difference between 1 and 16 15 right so what is the difference between 2 and 17 15 3 and 18 15 4 and 19 15 5 and 20 15 6 and 21 15 that's it hope you got the idea from 41 to 50 focus on the unit digits only and plus 15 will be the answer for the first two digits of a square 41 to 50 first two digit values will be plus 15 so this is 1 plus 15 16 2 plus 15 17 3 plus 15 18 4 plus 15 19 of course this one we do know that no need to go ahead with the plus plus 15 because ending with the five squares you do know that and 6 plus 15 how much 21 7 plus 15 22 8 plus 15 23 9 plus 15 24 and this one also not required so clear how to remember if i say 47 square so what is the first two digits so what are all the first two digits 47 square means 7 plus 15 22 what are all the other two digits next two digits we need to remember right first two digits yes sir you said plus 15 we can easily remember what are all the next two digits means again only focus on the unit digits only so you need to always focus on the unit digits only and 
1 is there that has to be subtracted from 10 and take the square value. So what does that mean? 10 minus 1. How much? 9. 9 square 81. So 1681 is the answer for 41 square. And here 2 is there. 10 minus 2 how much? 8. 8 square 64. 10 minus 3 how much? 7. 7 square 49. We call it as reverse square or indirect square so 41 to 50 what is the rule means so consider only the unit digit values plus 15 and last two digits will be indirect square or reverse square so if i say 43 square what is 3 plus 15 more 18 under 10 minus 3 means uh, 7 7 square 49 so 1849 is the answer if i say even 46 how much is the answer 6 plus 15 how much 21 10 minus 6 means 4 4 square 16 21 16 is the answer even uh, directly i'm going ahead with the 49 49 means how much it will come so 9 plus 15 how much 24 so 9 is there 10 minus 9 1 1 square 0 1 because 4 digit values right so 49 square means 24 0 1 is the answer so 44 square 4 is the unit digit 4 plus 15 19 and at 10 minus 4 how much 6 6 square 36 1936 is the answer 46 square what is the unit digit 6 6 plus 15 21 10 minus 6 4 4 square 16 here 47 square 7 plus 15 22 10 minus 7 3 3 square 9 we need to put 0 9 because we need to have four digit values till 99 square 48 square 8 plus 15 23 and 10 minus 8 2 2 square 0 4 here 9 9 plus 15 24 10 minus 9 1 1 square 0 1 that's it as simple as it is right 41 to 50 what is the rule plus 15 indirect squares plus 15 indirect square is the rule from 41 to 50 now we will go ahead with uh, 51 to 60 now if you observe keenly you can tell what is the logic behind 51 to 60 because 41 to 60 so unit digit and 16 1 and 16 2 and 17 how much is the difference plus 15 if you observe here again you need to consider only the unit digits here 1 and 26 2 and 27 3 and 28 4 and 29 how much is the difference mom 25 is the difference that means plus 25 plus 25 plus 25 plus 25 this one of course you do know that ending with the five squares no need to go ahead with this logic 6 plus 25 7 plus 25 8 plus 25 9 plus 25 this one also not required in 41 to 50 plus 15 and indirect square or reverse square we told right but in 51 to 60 plus 25 and the next two digit values last two digit values will be direct squares so it won't be indirect square or reverse square it will be direct square what does that mean direct square is nothing but one square we need to take not we need to subtract from 10 and take the square value directly we are taking square value one square itself what is one square means we need to put zero one because we need to get four digit values from 32 square to 99 squares right so 52 square 2 plus 25 how much 27 2 square 0 4 even easier comparing to 41 to 50 3 53 square 3 plus 25 how much more first two digit values 28 so 3 square 0 9 54 square 4 plus 25 how much 29 what is 4 square 16 56 square 6 plus 25 31 6 square 36 31 36 you can remember it as fancy number also what is 56 square 31 36 what is 56 square 31 36 what is 38 square hope you remember right 1 triple 4 what is 38 square 1 triple 4 what is 56 square 31 36 what is 57 square 7 plus 25 how much 32 and 7 square 49 what is 58 square 8 plus 25 33 and 8 square 64 59 square 9 plus 25 34 9 square 81 that's it so 41 to 50 what is the rule plus 15 and indirect squares and 51 to 60 
plus 25 and direct squares. We need to consider only unit digit values. Ma, can we sum it up now? 41 to 60. So what is the rule? 41 to 50 plus 15 and indirect square. 51 to 60 plus 25 and direct square. Now 41 square. 1 plus 15, 16. And 10 minus 1, 9 square, 81. 16, 81. 42 square, 17, 64. 43 square plus 15, 18. And 10 minus 3, 7 square, 49. 18, 49 is the answer. 44 square, 4 plus 15, 19. 10 minus 4, 6 square, 36. 19, 36 is the answer. 46 square, 6 plus 15, 21. 10 minus 6, 4. 4 square, 16. 2116 is the answer. 47 square, 7 plus 15, 22. 10 minus 7, 3. 3 square, 0, 9. 22, 0, 9 is the answer. 48 square, 8 plus 15, 23. 10 minus 8, 2, 2 square 0, 4, 2, 3, 0, 4 is the answer. 49 square, 9 plus 15, 24. 10 minus 9, 1, 1 square 0, 1, 2, 4, 0, 1 is the answer. 51 square onwards, 51 square, 1 plus 25, 26 and 1 square, 0, 1, direct squares, right? Last two digits from 51 to 60, 2, 6, 0, 1. 52 square, 2 plus 25, 27, 2 square, 0, 4, 2, 7, 0, 4 is the answer. 53 square, 3 plus 25, 28, and 3 square, 0, 9, 2, 8, 0, 9 is the answer. 54 square, 4 plus 25, 29, 4 square, 16, 29, 1, 6 is the answer. 56 square, fancy number, 31, 36. Or 6 plus 25, 31, 6 square, 36. 57 square, 7 plus 25. How much? 32, 7 square, 49. 32, 49 is the answer. 58 square, how much? 8 plus 25, 33. 8 square, 64. 33, 64 is the answer. 59 square, 9 plus 25. How much? 34. And 9 square, 81. Again, 1 and 9 squares always ends with 1, 2 and 8 squares ends with 4, 3 and 7 squares ends with 9, 4 and 6 squares ends with 6, 5 with 5 and 0 with 0. So here also same, right? So any square number will be ending with the values of 0, 1, 4, 5, 6, 9. Whenever a number is ending with 2, 3, 7, 8, it is not at all a perfect square. So in the next session, we will discuss uh, two digit squares and also three digit squares with the shortcut methods and all. Thank you very much uh, friends and uh, students.